Hi mateys, it's Dazzling Latte, and welcome back to Nightmare of the Snow. Okay, so last episode we had a cute kitty cat, and an old lady helped us, and everything was okay. Okay, so... What's going on now? I, I forget. <laughs> no, I don't. I just filmed the last episode. I don't know why I said that. I got coffee, I'm a little jittery, I don't know. Wait, who are you? I mean, where are you? There's not much time. Please. Please, save my sister. What's going on? Yukiko, do you have any siblings? I actually was going to have one, but my mom died while she was pregnant with my little sister. Why are you asking about it? Aww. Sorry to hear that. I just want to know. I am for you, Yukiko. Your little sister is still around, even though she's supposed to be in the afterlife. As for myself, they have already passed to the other side. Maybe. Several days later. Whew. I had a nice bath. Today the owner went to the village. She, she said she, that she was going to buy some ingredients for tonight's dinner. For the past few days, Haruto and I helped the owner to get money by putting some theatrical swordplay in the nearby village. Surprisingly, it became so popular thanks to Haruto's sword playing skills. But the owner is pretty late today. I hope she comes home soon. Oh no! Yukiko, is there something wrong in there? I also want to take a bath. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll get out soon. Yo, were you were you spacing out in there? Well, yes. <laughs> Jeez. Well, whatever. The owner's a little bit late, isn't she? It has been on my mind since this afternoon. She's usually back before the afternoon. Maybe something happened to her. But we shouldn't think negatively like that. Anyway, I'm off to take a bath. See you later. I think something bad happened. Like, oh, I know these kinds of games. Something bad happened. I have a bad feeling about this. Me too! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna go looking for her. Nope, can't do that. Okay, well, let's just go back inside. I wonder if I can... Yeah, no, 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 that's... Bad. Door's locked. I'm creeped out by this room. Like, I'm wondering why I can't look in there. Hello, kitty cat. He's so cute. Okay, let's go. Should I take a nap? I think I should take a nap before dinner. Right? I don't know what to do. Huh. Wait, where did the the one dude go? Okay, so we're not even questioning the fact that, you know, Haruto's nowhere to be found. Where's Haruto? He's supposed to be taking a bath. Like, is he hiding in one of the barrels? Is he... <laughs> okay, uh, is there like a doorway here? Like a hidden doorway? Where's Haruto? <laughs> he went in there! Oh my gosh. Let me just like... 
Okay, I'm gonna go back out to that statue. Oh no. Oh no! It's been a while since that day I found a message here on the statue. <gasps> no way! It can't be! Another message! I knew it! Yukiko found a piece of paper on the ground and proceeded to read it. Tonight we're going to bring you back to your home. <gasps> this is bad. I have to tell Haruto about this. Okay, now it's- oh no, oh no, uh-uh. Mm -mm. What was that? My family's- Kamen? Come on. Uh, why is it suddenly a, a popped him in my mind? Oh no. Oh no. I got a bad feeling. Where's Haruto? Where is Haruto? Okay. Oh, there he is. Oh, I don't trust this. Why is he turned around? Okay, good. I thought he was just gonna, like, eh, like just be this creepy monster. I don't know. What is it, Yukiko? You look so pale. Haruto, we have to run away. The ninjas of my dad found... Wait, what? <laughs> the ninjas of my dad who found our whereabouts. What? Take a look at this. Ugh. That guy is really persistent. Yukiko, don't you ever think about running away again. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. We need to get out of here. This is bad. If you had surrendered yourself back then, we wouldn't have to throw that old bastard off the hill. You heard me. No, not the old lady. She was so nice. Oh. Don't tell me the reason she hasn't came back was... What did he... No, this can't be. You're all going to pay for that. Haruto? <laughs> there you are, Haruto. Now return her. <laughs> My nose. Chief, you'll pay for this, Haruto. Okay, that doesn't sound good. Oh no, not Haruto. He was so nice. After rampaging a sound of slashing and stabbing, there was a long silence. Several minutes later, Haruto went back to the bedroom. His body was entirely covered by the blood of the samurais. He quickly cleaned himself and went back downstairs. Oh, you go down! You go down! His expression was a mix of sad and anger. His eyes were totally different from the usual. It scared me very much. Oh no. Oh no, what happened to him? <laughs> maybe it's not- and maybe it's because the first time I saw him got angry. He's a totally different person right now. Oh no. After a few minutes later, he called me to go outside. It seemed that he wanted to show me something. Apparently he found the corpse of the owner. He found her on the river downhill, floating lifelessly, covered in cuts and bruises. Oh yeah, because we, we really want to see that. Like, we really want to just, oh, let's just run outside and look at that. Like, we know she's dead. We don't want to. I don't want to. <laughs> uh, the moment I saw her corpse, I screamed out hysterically for the first time in my entire life. I've never seen someone die gruesomely before, even though there's been a lot of people died just for my dad's pleasure. Ooh, that's creepy. Just the way that's worded, that is just creepy. And on the next day... Okay, I'm kind of creeped out by Haruto now. Owner, today we're leaving your inn. Aww. We're moving far, far away from here. I hope you're fine with us gone. I don't trust Haruto anymore. He seems creepy now. We'll visit your inn again whenever we get the chance. We really appreciate the, everything that you did for us. We're really in your debt. I guess this is goodbye. 
Yukiko, are you still there? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you. Hey, it's okay. Is there something wrong? No, I'm just making sure that you're okay. It's not safe being around this place anymore. Yeah, my dad could come by any, any you know, until now. I still can't forgive myself for making this happen. If I hadn't chosen this in, Naruto, you shouldn't blame yourself. I'm the one who is guilty, you know? That's right. It's my fault for deciding to stay at this inn for a while longer. It's all my fault. That Chiaochi... One day, I'll make him pay for all of his doings. I can't believe that I was living with that scum for 12 years. Up until then, he kept putting up his mask to encourage me to become a part of his family. I was completed, completely tricked by that scum. Come, we must leave this place fast. After that, we began our journey. It was a long, long journey. We traveled for months. I don't even know how we got, how far we got away from the inn. There's no going back. We kept walking through everything. Mountains, forests, wastelands, caves, and some fields of thick reeds. And many other places. What a bad moment for it to rain. Yeah. But I'm glad that I could feel and see what rain is. I had no idea what rain was before. For real? Well, I understand though. At your mansion it always snows. What causes that? It's because of Hikami. Hikami? Hikami is the spirit of an ice god. My ancestor sealed him away deep inside the mansion's cave. I see. Glad I brought you out, although we're both we're now both fugitives. You know, my dad used to be a kind and gentle person. Really? Yeah. My mother told me about it. He used to be a samurai who helps the poor and destroy the evil kind of person. An exactly different personality, huh? I wonder what made him into a cruel and cold-blooded person that doesn't even care about his own daughter. My mom told me that she'll tell me about it one day, but she died before she did. I was there when your mother was going to be buried. She was taking a good care of me back then. But I'm really sad about her death. Naruto sure is a kind person, but I wonder why my why dad picked him as my fiance. I thought my dad would have picked a person that had the same personality as him. Now that I think about it, I definitely won't refuse to be his. W what am I thinking? I'm getting really weird lately. <laughs> oh, she likes him! She likes him! <laughs> you can't go! Yes? Um, what is it, Haruto? Back then, if you know that I'm this kind of guy, would you still refuse to be my fiance? Ooh, he likes her too! He likes her too! What? Why are you asking about that? <laughs> Cause he likes you! <laughs> uh, forget it. Sorry for asking you such a question. What's getting into me? Somehow, I keep thinking about her. Hey, I'm just his bodyguard or something like that. There's nothing special between us. We should go right now. There's nothing to see from here unless it doesn't rain. Yeah, we should keep moving. A few days later. 
Okay, the music suddenly changed. Oh, I don't trust that scarecrow. I don't trust that scarecrow. <laughs> wow, we found a farm. Okay, this looks so familiar and so creepy. I, th I think I remember this. It wasn't this like snowy or something in like a previous episode. I remember this. Okay, I'm gonna end that episode here. So, for now I have to go, but until then, smooth sailing to you and your pirate crew. <laughs>